It's my honour to uh, accept this award tonight on behalf of Associate Professor Sean Walder, who sends her apologies. Uh, she went home unwell today, so I'm here on her behalf. Uh, I'd like to start by expressing uh, our gratitude to the Brain Foundation, to the generous donors who make this funding possible, and to the Foundation executive who have recognised what we think is um, valuable research. The work uh, that we're going to talk about today represents a combination of over 20 years of research uh, of our team that's we're trying to develop and find safer and more effective treatments for ischemic stroke. It's far from the work of one person, uh, it's the work of a passionate and dedicated team of scientists. Uh, professor, Associate Professor Sean Walder, uh, my supervisor Professor Sean Jackson, Dr Mike Wu who's here tonight and uh, my work as well. So ischemic stroke is the third most common cause of death and disability in Australia and I'm sure everyone knows someone who has been touched by it. Most, most of these strokes, 85% uh, of them are actually caused by a blood clot that blocks off blood flow to the brain. The mainstay of stroke treatment currently is to remove the blood clot as quickly as you can and get blood flow back into the brain. And there's two main ways that that happens at the moment. Uh, the first, it was mentioned earlier, where uh, a, a coil or a retriever gets put up into the brain and actually pulls the clot out. This is really effective in some patients, uh, but not everyone, so only about 10% of people are actually eligible to get it because of where their clot is and also where they live. The other way to treat stroke at the moment is to use a drug uh, which breaks down the blood clot and this has been quite effective in some patients but again not everyone. So the goal of our research is to develop, to develop safe uh, and effective ways of breaking down the blood clot that can work in conjunction with the tr current drugs that are available. Over the last seven years, we've developed uh, a new and novel preclinical model to test these treatments in the lab bench, uh, which we then hope to take into the clinic. We hope that th our lab work will give us uh, a way to accurately assess how these drugs work, are they safe, before we take it uh, into people. The funding from today uh, from the Brain Foundation will support this work, and we hope that this will ultimately lead to safer and more widely accessible stroke treatments for the 56,000 people in Australia who experience stroke every year. So thank you again for your support of our work.